Hi, uh, today we're going to be talking about, uh, uh, lately I've been uh, doing some research and reading some books and things like that on uh, homeschooling, and uh, I checked out some books at the library on homeschooling, uh, The one I, and I'm going to be doing a book review today, and the name of the book is called So You're Thinking About Homeschooling by uh, Lisa Wilchell, and as you can see, well maybe you can't see it, but it, uh, in that little square rectangle box under homeschooling it's the second edition so um, I don't know if there's a first or well obviously there's a first but I don't know if there's a third or anything later but the one I read is the second edition um, it, it's a pretty good book I'll, I'll admit um, you know the author and is probably a little biased toward homeschooling but you know that probably works well for some like me because I'm uh, pretty big on homeschooling and uh, and she, but it's actually handled a little bit differently. I think there's, a, if I remember correct, there's about 15 different families in it, and uh, and you, you, I mean, besides the author herself, it's like, like you, you know, each person tells their story, and they range anywhere from uh, you know Christian families to um, to uh, you know, there's a, I think there was a to some single parents to. Um, you know, families who are, there was one family who, uh, who the dad, you know, was on the road, you know, most of the year going from city to city. So they, you know, set up a, you know, like they, like they, like their home city was still, you know, it was their main city, but they, uh, but, you know, while they're on the road, they just homeschooled and the wife, you know, traveled, they ended up buying an RV. So, um, so basically what it is is each person will tell you, you know, their reasons for homeschooling, which everyone ranges in different. Some of them, they just wanted better education Some of, for their kids. Some of them, you know, it was planned to, be, to homeschool their kids from maybe even before they were born. Uh, some, uh, you know, was because of issues they were having at school. I, I think the story with the issues, with, I think the story that sticks out the most was, you know, there was this mom who... It was considering homeschooling, and she was really excited about it. And she mentioned the husband; he was like, "Absolutely not." And then what happened was, uh, I, I guess at some point the dad overheard this conversation at work. How his daughter was caught with some kids in the bathroom with uh, marijuana, and uh, basically the it's, the principal gave his daughter a warning and said, "You know, he wouldn't even tell the parents about." It. And he was so angry; he was like, "We're we're homeschooling next year." So. I guess that story kind of sticks out the most, and there was an. I think even one of the stories was um, about was a uh, was a teenager who was about fifteen who was being homeschooled, um, and it, it was interesting because his sister was in was in a, a public high school, so you know homeschoolers come in a variety of ways. And what's nice about this book is toward the back, you know, if you decide to homeschool, um, they have all kinds of resources. To I mean, it's like. You know, I'm gonna say uh, it's like uh, you know a whole chapter just on resources, so that's helpful if you're wanting to resource, uh, if you're wanting to, you know, look into the idea of homeschooling, or if you even decided to, you know, to get uh, books or whatever. Um, um, I'd say if there's one issue I have with the book, I, I think it would have been interesting if she interviewed a family that did try homeschooling and they uh, and basically it, it didn't work and they sent the kids back to public school. Um, I would have liked to have seen something like that, um, but you know, of course, this is coming from someone who's pretty big on homeschooling, and you know, my my daughter's only about two years old, and um, I mean, you know, I'm pretty confident my wife and I are gonna end up homeschooling her, um, especially with the uh, things I've seen of the school system now. Um, that's not to say maybe at a later, at least initially, we were planning to homeschool. That's not to say maybe in high school or something like that, if she's mature, if we feel she's mature and ready and if she wants to go to high school we may give her that option but I guess we'll see her on that time but anyway uh, that's my book review for today again the book is called uh, so you're thinking about homeschooling second edition by Lisa Welchel uh, take care